Hey everybody, welcome back to another episode of Jade Falcon Freeborn. So, let's have a look here. Um, let's go to the mech base first. Now, it's been a few days, in-game days, since um, we took on that smooth stone mission and stuff, and our main lance is basically still out of service. Got a few pilots back, it went like four days in, so we got almost all of our pilots back again. So we got enough to make up two lances, we just have Judge and Griff out of action right now. So I think we'll take on a couple more missions on this planet before we jump. Now we have enough sea bills to last a bit, so we're okay. Um, I wanted to start working on one of these mechs. I don't think we're going to get a chance to do that. We might. I don't. I still want to spend the sea bills at the moment. So what I'm going to do is, if we go to the contracts right here, we'll pull off a couple missions here, see how we do. Um, I think we'll do just fine. I don't think there's really anything like there's intelligence agent. Uh, it's against Ghost Bear. I don't really want to go against Ghost Bear, but I think we might have to. There's a Davian facility. Yeah, that's three and a half skulls, though. Um, I guess we go... This is against Ghost Bear as well. And I don't want to go up against two Elite Lances at the moment. So... Um, uh, Ravis Barn team to raid the facility, get our operative out to safety. And data. So that's going to be two lances that we're up against here, an intelligence agent. Um, let's start off with biological sample first. It's against Dave, and we're going, to, we're going to take our second lance in. We're going to go with this one. So let's negotiate. We're going to go full salvage, obviously. I mean, going full sea bills is a waste of, waste of time at this point, um, especially against this. So we'll do this, and we'll move our main lance out. And let's go with the way we've been playing before. Let's get the Screamer in here again. So which Mad Dog is this? Is this the one with the two ATMs or three? Two. Okay, so um, let's get our Lance in here. Hannibal, uh, right up here. Um, Avalanche can go in the Screamer. She did really well last time. Uh, and we've got Judge out, so let's bring... You know what? Let's bring... Uh, no, let's go with Eagle. I was going to say, let's bring Giant to get the XP, but she's a good distance away from getting gunnery. She, she still needs like 11,000 or something. I just uh, spent one point on getting her guts up so we can get some overheat threshold. Um, but yes, yeah, she's a ways off, so let's bring in Eagle. Um, this is a pretty good loadout, I think, so let's deploy and get this sucker done. All right, here we go. Extraction up on the hill. Not much of a facility, eh? Well, we're not jumping out of here. We're taking these guys on. Now this is exotic, right? <laughs> sure as hell is. Sure as hell is. It's just like home. Ironhold is a jungle planet too. All right. Let's get up in here. I'd rather be in the trees, I think. Let's move. Nova CEWSs are good, but the trees what make it need? even better. Um, I need you here. Engaging jump jet. Okay, let's reserve. I need yep. you. Here. Roger. Hostiles on sensor. Thank you for that. Oh yes. You know what we're doing next uh next series. Okay, so we got a mortis, a rifleman. Just a regular rifleman, eh? Condor and an archer. Oh, okay. Nice mech parts. You know, I've I still need to get an archer, or so not an archer, a rifleman in this game. I want to kill this mortis though. Let's get up. Try and stay hidden. It's gonna make our shot a little harder being in the trees, but I think we're pretty good here. And let's just fire. If he wants to expose himself. We'll show him why it's a bad idea. 
Don't go exposing yourself to the Jade Falcon Clan. Inflicted some heavy damage. What can I do for you? So I got a really good handle now, I think, on next season. On what the uh why you got a worse chance to hit with the ATMs, but a better chance with the because the other mechs have them in the shoulders. Why is it worse? Maybe I'm just outside of that. I could just be outside of range too. But the ERs are way better. I don't know. Whatever. Firing. More damage. Another hit like that and you're, toast. you're right. He is toast. Yeah, so I got a good handle on what next season's going to be. Not sure if you're going to enjoy it. It's not going to be... It's non-canon, meaning that it's, you know... Oh! Shoot, I didn't even see the second facility. It's probably good, though, that uh, they don't see us down here, either. It's probably good that uh, they're too far away, or else they'd be shooting me in the back. Let's get rid of this guy. Uh, what's the HE? There we go. See ya! All I gotta say is, screw you! Alright. Now, this rifleman, I want parts. Moving out. So, can we get legs? Maybe. Let's HE this up. Ooh, I think we got a lot of leg shots. We certainly did. Alright, so I think if I just pelt him now, can we get a, oh, we can get a side shot, but it's partly obscured, but that's okay. We're just going to fire straight on, keep our fingers crossed here. Come on. There goes the leg. Okay, perfect. I think I hit something good. I think you did too. Okay. If we can get four parts of a rifleman today, I'll be happy. Nice. 99% chance to hit. How much armor does it have in the leg? I got, oh yeah, I can see it down here now. Not, uh, really? Really? Ooh. Uh, let's just try for a headshot. Nope. We got a leg shot though, it looks like. We did. Nicely done. And an arm, okay. Yeah, pretty good shooting, Tex. Ah, uh, standard rifleman loadout, eh? Reporting minimal damage. Yep, standard <laughs> rifleman heat sinking too. I always love the look of the rifleman, just that the heat sinking on it, it was just ridiculous. Like, how do you, you put two AC-5s, two large lasers, and two medium lasers, what are you thinking? And not dropping any heat sinks in the damn thing. It's like, what are you, I don't even know. Uh, let's get you on this condor. I read you, Commander. Moving out. Um, is it better? It doesn't really matter. Let's just go with the other ammo then. I want to save the HE for the close fights. Let's get you up here. We don't need to get up on that side. Oh, well that was unfortunate. We don't need to get up there because we can just jump up. Copy that. The thing is, is I'm staring at the rifleman while I'm moving. That's the problem. Raven. Stay away from those guys if we can. I might get the lamb to tackle with the archer. I don't know yet. Sorry to tangle it with the archer. We'll see. Mm hmm. Uh huh. Location confirmed. God, this is like 
freaking me out here. Okay, that's the far side, unfortunately. There's the front. Um, let's see if we can target this rifleman's legs. 72. So let's do this. Confirm it. And... We're going to miss with a lot, so that's fine. So let's go this way. Uh, and we're going to target the leg. See if we can get it. Ah, uh, quite enough. All we need is one hit. Yeah. We gotta restabilize ourselves. Look at this. Like there's like barely using up any heat in this planet. Let's target this leg. God, chances to hit are amazing. Confirmed. There we go. Ah, if we had had this this mech earlier, Avalanche should be like racking up the kills. I want to pick up some laser, more laser, laser AMSs if we can too, so I'm going to keep my eyes open for those. I hate having to carry the ammo. I mean, the mechs that, the, like our mechs here that have case and everything, that, you know, it's fine. Carrying the ammo and stuff, it's, it's okay. But if we can get rid of it so that we don't have to use it, that's the best bet. Uh -huh. Now, we want to go after... Who is this guy here? The trebuchet? He hasn't been firing, really, so... Let's see if we can finish up this vehicle. Here we go. Yeah, I'm enjoying the ATM loadout on this, on this sort of low-end, heavy, high-end, medium build. It's kind of nice. They hit nice and hard. They've got good chances to hit because they've got built-in um, Artemis control systems. So, you know, I, 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 I'm really, really enjoying it. As long as you can mount enough of them to make a difference. Like, like we got, what, 27 on two mechs and 24 on another. So, like, that's enough, I think, to make a difference. There we go. But if you've only got, like, a pair of nines... Yeah. You know, that's like sort of high-end, mid-range, medi uh, medium mech, range, mech uh, builds, I think, would work okay on. Waiting for orders. But the heavier mechs you're f that, that you end up fighting... Um, let's go after this archer. Stay in the trees back here. Maybe we can stay right. hidden. Um, like I was saying, the heavier mechs that you're going against, you'll want more of them, for sure. I mean, I guess it's really that, that, that way with anything that you do, but... Still, it's just, it's like SRMs and, yep. and um, LRMs that, I, well, especially SRMs at the uh, um, higher end of the battle. Let's do this. Oh, that was weird. We jumped over it and it saw, thought we were in the actual uh, hex there. That's pretty cool. All right, as far as straight this guy, well, actually, you know what? Should we do one of, we want to do one of these? No, I think we just want to shoot him. Here we go. Ooh. Now we can pinpoint strike him next turn. He's pretty much done, I think. Yeah. Yeah, you had no choice. Lerms aren't going to hit that close range. Unless you're clans, of course. Well, 145. Ah, I don't. He's not running an XL engine, so... Shit, we got to run through the uh, fire here. Or do we? We don't actually have to... We don't even have to run through the fire. This is the trebuchet. I'm gonna warlord this one. Give us a good shot to hit and fire. Okay, so this isn't the LRM trebuchet. It's the 7K. Right? So he's got like, what? What has he got again? PPC and AC and an SRM2. It's kind of a weird ass loadout. Like, the SRM-2 is, like, really not even worth it. It's one of those things you j jam on a light mech if you got nothing else you can put in it. Solid connection, that one. What else do we have? Phoenix Hawk. Oh, okay, Yusha. Hope I'm getting that right. On my way. Hope I'm getting that right, guys. Copy that. I think they're having difficulty seeing us up here. Okay, see what they do here. 
Man, we're so fast. Oh, they can see us now. So I'm going to look for that lamb mission on the uh, next series to see if we can pick up one of these screamers. Because it would be nice to having, or at least just try and build one ourselves. See if we can get this. Yep. Cord. Nicely done. So I guess they're using the uh, trebuchet as a scout mech. It's fine. What can I do for you? Totally fine. You can eat a face full of this. He's under the Raven's ECM right now, so... Mm, can you get a direct line of sight? I don't think you can. That fire's encroaching on us, so we're gonna back up a bit. Still gonna go after the treb. Yeah, he's under the Raven's ECM, so... He's a little bit protected. That's okay, though. We still got a fair number of missiles. We still have our HE, too, right? So... That's well, the same chance. Let's just run with the HE on this one. What do you need? Um. Going full throttle. No sense jumping if you don't have to. Makes you unstable. So. Okay. Who's this guy again? Oh, that's the, is that the Raven? Well, that's the Raven. The asset is in hand, Commander. Good work. We always do good work, man. Waiting on you, Commander. This is Team Two. This ain't no Team One. Affirmative. All right. Let's make our way to the second spot here and hammer him. There's more where that came from. Okay, I want mortars and grenade launchers in that guy till he's gone and everybody else in the Phoenix Hawk, please. Ooh, you're heating up something awful, eh? Let's turn both of those off. Switch the ATMs to HE and get rid of this guy. You certainly did. Yep. Confirm. Yo, what's up? Copy that. Huh. <laughs> Scared you, did I? Yeah, I'm looking at double large laser build on that. Not really, like, it's it's not a huge punch to it, but it's punchy enough. Hmm. Let's see, let's get a little closer. Get a little closer with air it extra dry. Let's fire some regular ammo on him. Force him to run away if we can. Oh. That's all right. Waiting for orders. Talking to us like we don't know what the hell we're doing. Pedal to the metal. That's a problem. Ooh, shred him. Fuck. That was a mistake on his part. And stay down. Good 
to go. Let's get this Raven. Roger. Full speed. And we got HE up now. Firing. I hope we can salvage that. Commander. I don't. You want Raven parts? Seriously? Seriously, you want Raven parts? Um, yeah, same sh same damage with both, or same uh, targeting chance with both. That is. What do you need? I need you to make him come to us, please. Thank you. Um, hmm. Let's see if we can burrow through this guy. Confirmed. Oh, he's gonna go down. Gonna reserve avalanche. <clears throat> Actually, you know what? No. We gotta get the secondary asset, so. Ooh, that's a back shot. What do you think, guys? Should we land in the uh, rough? I am kind of famous for that. Let's fire on this guy. I'm taking this job. Good to go. It's not going to be standing up very longer. And HE. Let's warlord this up because we got it. And here it comes. Tell me what to shoot. See ya. All right, we got this. Waiting on you, Commander. Yes, Commander. I wonder if they can make this so it's it's adaptable, so that if you blow through the competition like this, they can add another lance at the end. Because that would kind of be cool. All right, let's see what we got. Contract payment increased by thirty percent. That I don't know. It probably will cover our damages. I think. Uh, the Mad Dog did take a few hits. We'll see. It might cover our repairs. Okay, so we were looking at... Where's the Rifleman? Oh, the Mortis is 75 tons? Oh, yeah, I got... I, I'm thinking X Mortis. Man, he went down fast. Um, where's the Rifleman? Now, I don't know if we got Rifleman parts or not, but... Yeah, let's have a look here. Nothing else I really want out of this. It's all standard junk. So let's grab four rifleman parts. Just because it's a rifleman and I like riflemen. Alright, what do we got here? Two mortis parts, Phoenix Hawk, the rifleman parts, and some garbage. I'll probably hang on to these ER mediums because we don't really have all we don't have any clan ones right now, so alright, it's confirmed. Let's continue. Alright. Let's have a look here. 34,000. Excellent. Nice. That was good. All right. Now we can run a second lance here. Okay. Uh, we didn't get a rifleman, but that's all right. Uh, let's have a look at the contracts. We're going to jump right into another one. Just because. Intelligence agent. Let's do this one. And we're going to go full salvage because we're going against Ghost Bear. We're going to drop some in rep with them a little bit, but we can build it back up again afterwards. And I'm thinking we're going to want mobility on this one. Um, mobility and a bit of firepower. So let's go with... Uh, okay. You and you. You and you. C has got, what do we have on C again? The two PPCs and the LRM, and this is the Rotary 5. Okay. There's our speed. Let's go with Rhino, and we're going to go with Giant, because, well, you know, we don't have anybody else. So let's do this. Alright, we got to get serious here. Evac zones over there, huh? So, 
the size of your head. Huh. At least the size of your hand. All right. Uh, we know how this one goes. We get exposed. They shoot at us. Commander. We got heavy sustained firepower, so we're okay, I think. Hey. Hey. Okay, let's go. Waiting for orders. Gonna stay in the trees if I can as long as possible. I just want to see what we're up against if we actually spot anything. Okay, something already. What do we got? Turkina. Well, we need to kill that guy. Yes, Commander. We need to kill everybody. I don't know why we're uh, talking like that. I copy. Okay, we got Blood Asp. Direwolf. Nice. Orion. 2CA. And then a Turkina. Okay. They're gonna spot us. They're clans, they can't, yeah, they can't not spot us. All right, we need heavy sustained firepower on that guy. Let's get into here first. Um, who do we want? Dire Wolf probably? Well, I want parts from the Dire Wolf, so I don't know if I want to kill him first. <sighs> wow. That bad, huh? Let's go with the best chance to hit. Okay, that blood asp I think is overextending himself. So let's take advantage of that. Um, I wish we had this already. Let's just shoot him. Thanks for showing up. Ready for orders. How far can you get up? We can get to the... Yeah, no, I don't want to... Chances are, if you're slow now, you're going to be slow next turn. It's so difficult on this train telling who can see what from where. Okay, I think here we're safe, though. Staying out of the rough terrain. That looks pretty good. Got a side shot in this guy. Let's open the rack up. We're getting basically free hits here, so let's take them. If we're going to actually hit two of them, huh? You know what it is? She's not used to that. Do I want to go after this guy, or do I want to go after the... You're going to get a chance to see me in a minute. Um... Do we reserve? I think so. I want to wind both those racks up. We're a little, we're safer on this side simply because of this hill. If I go here, yeah, I think we'll be okay here. Although, you know what? We're gonna be even safer here, I think. As bad as it looks, we're I'm turning my wrong side to this guy, but that's fine. LRMs have got a terrible chance to hit, so I'm gonna pull those off at some point. 
I got thunder as well. Let's fire the swarm. Nice shooting. Hopefully he doesn't get away from me. So he goes on turn 20. Standing by. Can we get... We can. Give him somebody to melee. Alright. Now we do this. And we fire on his side. Hopefully we're going to pull his arm off, but... Heavy SP Goss rifles, really? There goes the arm. Lost evasive. Yep, you realize you overextended, didn't you? They've got a sensor lock on me. Realize the overextended. At this point, does it really matter? If I go, yeah, I'm, I'm okay down in here, I think. Right? In the valley? Let's get down in there. Oh, yeah, baby. There's the rotary chance. That's what I want. Hammer him. Good to go. Gonna vigilance six pack because we're coming after that guy. Um, right here. I, I want to get him out of that location. So let's um, let's remove this blood asp, please, and thank you. Guy's taking punishment. Solid connection on that one. He's done next turn, though. So that was basically a free kill. Ooh, nice. Okay, Orion is our second target. Now, can we get sight on him? We can, uh, but I don't want to be too far up on the hill. It'll allow the Turkina and the Direwolf to be able to shoot me. Ooh, we just got a medium pulse left, huh? Well, should have looked at that before I moved. Wow, he took a shot to the head, too. See if we can finish him up with a headshot. Nope. Oh, he bailed out, though. <laughs> yes, Commander. I don't blame him. He's like, GTFO, our racks are jammed. So it doesn't matter. We still gotta go after this guy. And firing. I think it's better that they're they're they were jammed that last turn. They become unjammed. And then that way when this dire wolf appears, he's gonna get full racks to the face. I'm under heavy fire. <laughs> Thanks for pointing out the obvious. We got your back. Just hang on, buddy. Commander? That was my bad. Rolling. That was my bad. What do we got here? 84, 74. Um, okay, Birdie, let's start this off. We could take his head clean off. No, we can't. We need 70. Oh, he's got a lot of internal structure. Um, do we just shoot him and hope we op hopefully we open something up? I think we do. Let's just shoot him. Let's get the hits on. Hopefully we open something up here. Got tag on. Good stuff. Oh, we got a leg hit. Nice. It's going to be helpful. As long as they're spreading their fire around, I'm good with that. 
Okay, so let's get Giant okay. down here. Can you get in to actually get a good clear shot on anybody? You can. So we're gonna do this. We're gonna split fire. We're gonna fire on you and you. B is taking this and we're gonna drop some thunder on him. Might as well start some leg damage. That's not that much harder. All right, who's going first? Looks like they're Orion, probably. Yeah. I'm taking heavy hits, Commander. Yeah. Well, he's once again overextending himself. What's up, boss? Racks are up. Joyous day. Um. Hammer him. What? No. I need another multi target, please. We're doing the same thing and firing. Engaging multiple enemies. Nice to get that second minefield in there before he moves. I'm here. Let's get our asteroid over here. And we're gonna multi you and you. B is taking one. And the tag, because we've already got tag on A. Actually, you know what? This is gonna go to B. This is gonna go to A. I'm gonna fire this way. Ten four. Okay, he's unsteady. Oh, you missed! Oh <gasps> no! Negative damage. Repeat. Negative damage. I see that. Good to go. Question is now. That's our left side. This damage. Let's turn more to the right then. Right. Okay, buddy, you got a multi, unfortunately. I'm gonna knock both of these guys on their asses, I think. Full wind up, and here's the pitch. Okay, I got an arm. Oh, yeah, baby. Wonder if there'd be reinforcements. There's the Turkina. Took 21 leg damage. That's not bad, not bad. I mean, considering we had such a hard chance to hit. That's four LRM hits. When he's not in cover. Okay, nice. You tried, and that's what's important. Receiving you. Can you do me a favor and end their uh, guy here? On my way. Just end this guy, please, if you can. Uh, just go for headshots, because why not? I don't know if he's, um... I copy. Don't know if he's running a, an XL or not. Let's find out. Five. Yep. That's a kill. Didn't want to draw that... Right didn't want to destroy that many components, but we didn't really have much choice. Uh... Okay, once again, doing a multi. Let's 
Drop some more thunder on that guy, because why not? Somebody's got some ATMs. Taking leg damage. Uh, can you get back around to the dire wolf? You can. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Pretty good chances to hit. Um, do we try for an OP or do we just shoot him? That leg's pretty open. Uh, she's pretty reliable, so let's go this rate. This way here. Oh my god, you're so reliable! Slight damage. Holding firm. Thanks for showing up. Come on, people. Let's make it happen. Hashtag making it happen. Got two racks up. Let's say F you to this Turkina. He wants to come into the battle. Let's show him what the battle looks like when he gets here. You still want to stay? Whoop. My mech is coming apart around me. He still wants to stay. Hey. Alright, we're in the end game. Oh, did I move too far? I didn't. Okay, good. Whew. That's a big overheat alert. <sighs> what do we got for legs here? 135 and almost nothing. Uh, let's see if we can pull this guy's leg off. Nicely done. Can we get that second rack on this uh, Turkina, please? He's really bothering me now. Let's get a solid blue color if we can. Uh, we, are we just gonna hammer him? Hmm. What's the OP looking like? Pretty damn good with the rack. Let's go. There we go. Proved ATM gone. Sure as hell has. Yes, Welcome on. to the fight. Can we just get a shot on one? No, we can't. Okay, Dire Wolf still isn't gone. We're shielding our arm. Uh, we need two hits. No. We need two hits if we do this. Let's do it. Copy that. Nicely done. Go time. You got that right. Mech destroyed. Ready for orders. Racks are up. Moving out. Can you give this guy a big F you? Thank you. You can finish giving this guy the finger if you don't mind. Panic level critical. This guy's been a pain in my ass. Let's get rid of him. Bye. That's a kill. 
Sure as hell is. Nicely done, guys. Took a bit of damage, but I think that was... Well, I don't know if it was unavoidable or not, but... A couple, couple of questionable movements, but pretty much overall that was pretty good. Um, don't know if we're going to get reinforcements, but let's get in here and turn like this. Oh boy, here we go. Stop complaining. Swarm. I think I'm going to pull the Lerm 15 off this thing. I think it's pretty much of a waste right now. Let's get those racks into play. Waiting for order. Just in case they do get reinforcements. Ooh, yeah, let's stay out of the minefield though. Aye, aye. The there it is, folks. Well, that was a nice fight. Well, 30,000. I don't think this is going to be enough to cover repairs, but we'll see how it goes. Yeah, we did take a bit of damage. I think moving that Orion forward when the racks were jammed was a big mistake. But we did get the kill eventually on the other mech, so we don't really have dire wolf parts. Uh, do we want components? I mean, I, made, I spent all the time making sure we got the dire wolf. But it doesn't look like there's anything amazing down here. We lost the TT the one TTS weapons. There is the clan exchanger. You know what? I think I want C bills to upgrade the current mechs that we do have. So let's go with these four. And enhanced imaging. How much do we have? We don't have any. And get a clan exchanger. Because we definitely need the exchanger. Let's go with these four. We'll sell the two XL engines. That's a couple of million right there. That'll get us our XL engine into the um, catapult. Yeah. And let's hope for some mech parts. Oh, we got four direwolf parts. That was l so lucky. All right, ER large, some ATMs, some improved ATMs. If we didn't get improved ATM ammo, it's not worth it. We did. We got Inferno ammo, but, you know, whatever. Clan double heat sink, medium pulse. We got, we had over 40 of these at one point. These are, these things are worth like, I think, 200 and something to sell? I sold a crap ton of these at one point. We made so much money. Um, yeah, so that's that's actually not a bad haul. I don't know if we'll use the ATM-6, but we got these. We got two of these now. Okay, nice. All right, 159,000. Yeah, I knew it was going to be expensive. Alright, not too bad. We didn't get a dire wolf, but, you know, so if we had taken all the dire wolf parts, we wouldn't have gotten it anyway. So that's probably a good thing we didn't do that. Now, we need to sort of, we're going to be jumping systems. So, let's bring the Kerberos up to the top again. Let's bring the King Crab up. Because we do want these guys back sooner rather than later. Okay, so now what can we get up and running quickly here? We can get our second lance for sure up. Let's do this. Uh, and the exterminator. And that third bay. Could bring the Yorman Gundir up. Uh, above the Orion and the Amelia. Because it's only five days. So that's going to be... Let's see here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Twelve days. And then we'll be down to just these guys. And that'll put a dent into the Kerberos and the King Crab. Yeah, we got some serious repairs to do. Um, kind of, what do we got left in the bay? It's not much, right? It'll be an interesting mixed bag. Well, we got these three still. It'll be an interesting mixed bag next episode with what mechs we're going to end up using. So we should have. I could look for a planet that's 22 days away because I mean we're going to be going over to our financial report anyway. But if I look for something 12 days or anywhere like short distance. We should have enough for two lances. Um, maybe we take a couple more harder missions, but maybe we're going to have to jump into clan space, I think. Ghost Bear, pick up some rep with Ghost Bear. Um, so that we can come back into Comstar territory. We can sell stuff too, so we'll have lots of sea bills. We can work on the other two mechs that we've got down. Yeah, we'll see how it goes. I mean, I wish we had more mech base because we've got a lot of repairs to do. 
Um, the other thing is to pull the Kerberos out of action until we have, you know, some more stability in the mech bays right now because these repair times are starting to rack up. Um, but we'll see how it goes. I'm going to keep the uh, the King Crab and the Kerberos up in the uh, top of the line here until we can get them back into service. And then I'll force the Dire Wolf back into service. Because the Dire Wolf is mostly armor damage and stuff, whereas the uh, King Crab and the um, Kerberos need some internal repairs. So, yeah. All right, we're going to leave it there. All right, I'm going to end the episode, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And you can drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you all later.